create your goals with God's due dates. I repeat that again. Create your goals with God's due dates. I repeat that again. Create your goals with God's due dates. What that means is take an action regardless if you know when something is going to happen. You know, we hear the saying where do we hear the saying where we don't know the north we don't know the time nor the hour you know and that's related to when jesus is gonna come and um what is explained in revelation will come to pass and also throughout the whole entire books but i was just sitting here thinking about things that have happened in my life when i let go of control and trying to mark off dates when things were going to happen and they didn't happen of course it was a disappointment to me but when I just work towards um, my goals and learning how to be obedient I learned that my due dates don't mean nothing my uh, dates of accomplishing things don't mean anything so while driving on this road I like taking road trips whether that's traveling on a plane or just in the car traveling through different states for pleasure and sometimes for business whenever that happens but mainly it's been for pleasure i get a lot of my good thoughts on this road right just thinking just sitting in quiet sitting in um sitting in peace sitting without sound um just sitting here talking with god and just looking at everything around me on the roads and stuff like that and but anyway this thought came to mind if we learn how to we set out goals right and of course we have like you know i want to have this completed by this day this completed by that day like that's cool but something just like really struck um just really a light bulb went off in my in my head if we set goals and take actions whether that's like um so if you have a goal and you have i like to keep things simple so if i have a goal i try to just um create three simple steps for that goal and just work towards them without having a due date in mind or a, a date where i want to get something completed by with certain things like i i um like certain things like for example for example like tests that you need to take for like certifications and stuff like that stuff like that of course you have to like schedule that stuff at the time and study for it but this is more so related towards your goals if we learn how to set a goal create three simple actions that we need to take in order to make that goal achievable and underneath the due dates for them put god's due date and that could be whenever because we don't know the time nor the hour you know um We'll get that phone call for saying that we got a job. We got that job. Or well, we get a phone call saying that um, we get a phone call saying that we got a job. Or um, if you apply for a job, the recruiter done called for an interview. We know we don't know the time nor the hour that we will call for that. Even the recruiters don't know the time or the hour they're going to do something when they wake up first thing in the morning. Of course, they have their plans and things they have to do and stuff like that, but. God marks all of that. So just imagine if you were to just set your goals and then create three actionable steps for each goal. And then for the due date, just put God's due date. Because you don't know. But as long as you're working towards, as long as you're working on those action plans that are related to the goal each and every day or whenever you have time to and you're focused on that, you'll be really amazed at how fast things can happen. When you just start to just put one one step in front of the other, keep things simple. No matter how hard or how no matter how hard you think a task is gonna take, and when I say task, those are the action, the actions you have to take. So action tasks, task actions, call it whatever. But once you start taking, put one foot in front of the other. So you take step one and step two, and not look at it as like, oh my gosh, I gotta do all this work. Just take the action, because you'll be surprised that God's due date may come quicker than the due date that you thought um the it may come god's due date may come quicker than the due date that you had set forth to complete a task so have that in mind you know um like if it's goals you want to achieve or a certain amount of money you want to save up work towards have the goal 
take action on the action task and for the due dates leave that up to god you just never know how god is going to work how quickly he's going to work and those actions that you have associated with the goal is you just taking a leap of faith a walk of faith faith action action of faith i'll say i'll call it in order for that goal to be achieved so i like how i just thought about like you know we don't know the time though the hour for anything we don't know the time of the hour. Like I said, we're going to get that phone call saying that we got approved for that apartment. We got approved for that, um, pre-approved for that loan. Or the how, the closing, the closing and everything went went smooth. Or, you know, you don't know the time of the hour where you might walk to the mailbox and see that there's a check in the mail. Or you might, you don't know the time of the hour where you might check your account. Even if you're a person that check it on a regular and you see there's an extra couple of dollars in there. You don't know the time or the hour when the blessings are going to hit. But as long as you take action towards your goals, anything is possible with God. Matthew 26 says, asking you shall receive. And I believe that. And you got to believe that. So if there's anything that you want, speak it out loud. Okay, goals you want to achieve, write them down. Speak them out loud. And then think of three simple Three simple action steps, uh, action tasks that you have to take. No matter how how much work is required to complete those actions, just keep it simple, and you can achieve anything that you need to achieve on God's due date, not yours.